right, we are here in Blightfire Moors to get the uh, explore the Knoll mining camp. Uh, we're gonna go do that and get some rocks uh, to complete that quest. I'm not exactly sure where we have to go uh, in these mining camps to trigger it. There we go. Get three piles of rocks. So this will be rather easy. Uh, we are. Uh, Not sure why our mercenary is not fighting. Not sure she is. Oh, she's in passive. I set her to passive. All right. So last time we were here, this was uh, pretty difficult. All right, we got one pile of rocks. Just guess it looks like we just click these. Or no, we just walk over them. That's even easier. Uh, let's see, simply adept figurine. All right, we'll take that. That's something that might sell. There we go. We're just making a little, making money, making that sweet, sweet five gold. All right, let's get that one. All right, we got three of them. Now we need to go back to. Uh, let's see. We need to go back to the camp, speak to him, and kill some thugs. That's what we I plan to do this episode. So. Yeah, I don't even think I did the intro. <laughs> I'm thinking on now, but who cares at this point, right? It's No More Guard's journey, and well, uh, here we are. Uh, let's see here. Let's go north to. Uh, we'll uh, go to Mesa, and we'll be right back. Hello and welcome back to No More Guard's journey. We just. Uh, Took care of some knolls in uh, Blightfire. <laughs> By Blightfire, jeez. Just got another quest item just running around. Uh, Blightfire Moors. So we got some fresh uh, mess of steam water for another quest. Uh, we need to go speak to the Tuffins. Uh, and then we need to go speak to Devon. And then we need to go kill some centaurs. So yeah, we got uh, get, getting things done here. <laughs> I don't even... I've... Uh, kind of lost track of what episode this is. I think it's episode 41 um, overall. Uh, and this is what I have. That's pretty much what I have planned for this episode. So we'll see where we end up after that. All right. Uh, who do we turn this into? Sneak into the Tuffin camp. Sneak into it? Uh, it doesn't even make sense. Oh, these are the min minnows. All right, so we're in the wrong camp. <laughs> All right, we got to go to the other camp. These are the uh, minnows. So let's just go kill centaurs real quick and get that done. All right, let's go this way. All right, he wanted us to kill thugs. So I'm assuming one of these is a thug. Those are lung dungs. That's a shaman. That's a courser. That's a charger. Charger. That's a charger. That's a... All right, let's just kill one of these guys because this guy's going to attack us anyway. Let's just kill this guy and see if he, in fact, is a thug. Maybe that's what. They're trying just generically saying kill thugs. And let's drop and venom on him. And I did pick up my uh, level 52 spells. Oh, we got a we got an ad. Ah, uh, see, let's drop that. Wow, oh, he's uh, resisting. Let's go to spells. Alright, uh, let's get rid of Splurt. Let's pick up, uh, we got Plague. That's gonna be a probably better, uh, better spell for us. I don't know how much damage it does, but it doesn't have the effect that Splurt does where it just slowly ramps up. And it does 156 every time, so that's just gonna work out for us. A lot better. All 
right, we killed one and we got credit for it, so. In fact, that is a thug. All right, he's rooted. We don't want their crappy weapons to sell for four silver. I have no idea why they, uh, <laughs> like, I can, I can see the fine steel, you know, it's like five platinum pop, but, uh, yeah, I'm not really interested in, uh, carrying around four weapons that cost four silver, so. Alright, this guy should die quickly. And he got some fur. Spear we don't want. Centaur parts probably sell, and that probably sells, so. Got the Courser, he's already on us. Two of them, man, jeez. And these make South Karana centaurs look, uh, look rather weak. <laughs> All right, let's drop a plague on this one. And let's drop a incinerate, or ignite. Of a cascade. Yeah, he's gonna he's gonna be angry at us there for a few seconds, but we're gonna drop a uh, root, and he's dead. All right, go to the next one. Ignite, snare. Go ahead and get plague on him. And I'm gonna go with Invin Bolt one more time. And then he should start running at us once we get that on there. There we go, perfect. I'm gonna pick up Bond of Death. Uh let's see, this guy has the most hit points, so we're gonna bond to death him. Since all our dots are wearing off him anyway. Let's bond to death. There we go. All right. So there's an archer over here. Let's see if we can grab him. Grab the fine steel, leave the junk. All right, we need to get snare on him ASAP. And then root. Of course he resists. And let's get off the mount because it really makes it difficult to uh, kite anything. Uh, let's see if there's a DD component to the... Yeah, there is. It's 162 upfront damage for the... Uh, for that uh, disease. All right, we're at five of eight. Let's go ahead and grab the charger. Ignite blood. Venom bolt. I need to get plague on him. And then root him. Uh, snare does not have a uh, DD component, so it doesn't really affect... Uh, Root as much as the other ones, so that's good. Animals bond to death. And we'll sit. Oh, he died so fast. Uh, probably not getting the full benefit from uh, the bond of death casting it that late. All right, there's another one. Can we get him from over here? Yes, we can. Send the pet. Let's go ahead and root him. Bond to death him. And then snare. And then reroute him, because that's probably the worst root I've ever experienced. I should probably just use the low level root since it probably casts faster and uses no mo almost no mana at this point. There we go. So we'll just let them do a little bit more of their uh, their damage to him. And then uh, should heal, heal up by then. I, while I was in uh, POK, I did uh, refresh my, uh, my uh, buffs from my cleric. All right. 
Let me, uh, I gotta turn the heater on in my office one second while we, uh, met up a little bit more. I can do it from my phone, which is convenient. It's, like, really cold outside. Alright, so that's dead. Let's see, we need one more, so we're gonna grab this guy right here. Shaman that we cannot see because we're small. Got him. Bring him back over here. And Venom Bolt. Gonna send the pet. Venom Bolt didn't land because I didn't stop fully. I'm gonna plague him because he's probably gonna heal. Bond of Death. That got his attention. There we go, we got him rooted. There we go, and he has everything but snare, but he's dead. And we don't want his junk. All right, we completed that quest. Let's go back to uh, our friend over here. We can avoid getting attacked by all these other guys out here. All right, buddy. What do you got for us? In chat. All right. Thank you. I feel much better about the rest of my brothers now. Research numbers of, uh, now that the number of thugs have been reduced, would you be willing to do some research on them? All right. Okay. All right. We'll do that. We'll kill, we'll kill more of your brothers. Uh, let's see here. What does that want us to do? Search for the source of the corruption. And we are already aware what the source of the corruption is because we were attacked by it early on when we were exploring. So let's uh, see if we can invis, gather shadows. Man, the mercenaries at 20, 20 pat platinum a pop now. <laughs> That's pretty insane. All right. We're in viz. Let's run up here and see their camp. Now, I don't know where we need to go to trigger it, but it's this weird gassy cloud. There we go, we got it triggered. It says search for it. They only got Lois. He's rare. All right, we're gonna kill the rare, that's for sure. And we're going to dot him up so we try to get him out of the cloud. Oh, shoot. This guy summons. Gonna root him as soon as we can. Did not think he would summon. Is he resisting? Is that what it is? I'm resisting his stuff and he's resisting mine. There we go. He's rooted. Don't have to deal with the summoning anymore. Let's recast. Oh, and I guess we do have to worry about the summoning. Alright, we reignited him. Let's go ahead and drain his soul. Maybe we can get a little heal. All right, we got a centaur chain bracelet. That's actually kind of nice. Go ahead and take that, and that is junk. Let's leave that. All right, we need to find the shade thing that was attacking us. Uh, there it is, the shade of corruption. Uh, all these guys are on us now. Let's... Uh, Let's run for our lives. Pet's dead. That was did not work out the way I hoped it would. So let's uh, go up this way. We can just zone right here. All right. So that was quite a bit of a. Uh, Quite a bit of creatures. The Shade of Corruption is uh, 
the source of the corruption. So I'm not sure why that didn't trigger. I guess I didn't, I didn't see it. So that's probably why. All right, uh, let's go ahead and get Invoke Death out. But we take 50 damage a tick from the uh, the air, so it's kind of annoying to deal with. Plus, with all those centaurs there, it's kind of a kind of a uh, difficult little situation we're in. So we'll try that again once we get buffed our pet buff back up. And let's see here, invisibility. I think if I can just see the, uh, if I can see the thing we need to fight, then we should be good. I'm going to set my mercenary to passive and, uh, hopefully that will, uh, prevent her from fighting and then I may be able to feign death and avoid, uh, having to zone again. Oh, and I did get a new, uh, feign death spell. I just remembered that. Comatose. That was the level 52 spell that we got, uh, along with uh, Plague. And Plague seems to be working out pretty good. I mean, Splurt does more damage, I think, at the end. But uh, what the hell happened here? Oh, maybe those are all the ones I killed. <laughs> all right, uh, let's go up here. I just don't have Hide Corpse on. Uh, let's see if we can find it. Without having to go in here because so I think it breaks invisibility yeah if, second we go in it breaks invisibility so and we're gonna take uh yeah we got a bunch of crap on us now so let's just run around they're gonna kill our pet there's the shade there's the shade Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Run, 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 run. Alright, it's, it's... That's the source, but... It, it's not, uh... Alright, I can't feign death until, uh, cor this corruption wears off. Okay, I stopped breathing. Should be good. Uh, we'll wait on making another pet. Until <laughs> we figure out what's going on here. Why, why is it not triggering because we're finding the shade uh find the source of crush somewhere yeah i see it do we have to kill it yeah it's uh the next quest in the line so this is just we just have to find it the next one is to kill this this thing and it is a level 55 if i'm not mistaken yeah it's level 55 so we're not going to be able to kill it right away but <laughs> i don't know why we're not getting the uh the trigger to uh, advance the quest at this point. So, all right, you're good there. Let's, uh... yeah. Set her to aggressive. There we go. Uh, I do not have Bond of Death memorized. Let's just life tap him down. Can I heal up? Let's snare him. And then keep life tapping him. And just let her finish him off. There we go. We are full life. We can uh, do that. Go ahead and root him. And I won't, I'm not going to waste the bone chips on another ch another pet at the moment. Ah, uh, we got Simple Defiant, Simple Defiant. And whatever those bracers are. Pile of rocks, that's a quest item. Yeah, we're good. Just let her finish this guy off, and then we can go back and try to figure out why 
uh, why the quest didn't trigger. I'm sure there's a specific spot you gotta like go to, but you can't go in Viz, which is uh, unfortunate. And we can't kill him yet. Uh, I don't think we're gonna have to get up a few levels before we can do that. So let's invis up. Oh, we got one platinum from him. I didn't know the giants dropped money. It's nice to know. All right, let's get back over here. Let's see if we can go around the back side, maybe. There, there's a box. Maybe that's it. That's a rare creature, too. Storage crate. Open. No. Kill this guy while we're here. He's outside, uh... Let's loot. Alright, I can't loot that now, but... She's aggressive. Okay. Uh, snare him. Oh, he's not. It's not landing. There we go. Yeah, we need to get root on him as soon as possible. Because he is a summoner. Alright, there we go. He's rooted. So he's gonna die shortly. Come on. Alright, let's loot that. Leave those. What is this? This is an actual decent item. Uh, 1200 tribute, so... If anything, I'll go tribute it to my, uh... Well, this character doesn't have a guild, so I'm gonna probably need to make him a guild so he can get the tribute buffs. Alright, let's kinda like run around here. Yeah, it's gonna trigger because the smoke is everywhere let's run all the way around oh oh good we didn't get hit by it now we got hit by it there somehow all right so we gotta wait 12 seconds it's 50 damage it take it's pretty pretty severe at this level I just don't know how uh, to trigger this. I would assume the shade that we keep fighting is is the source of the corruption, but I don't know. God, 12 seconds. Let's see here. Yeah, I think we can kind of see him if we go right here. There he is. Do I dare to like run through there? I don't, my expedient recovery is down, so. I don't want to eat a death, so let's see if we can. There's a quest in here. We got two of them on us and the shade. And we can't make her passive yet, so we gotta just run. Uh, let's see here. We got stunned. And it still didn't trigger, so, uh, yeah. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and zone this and uh, get ready for it again. Alright, we're back at the centaur camp and we're gonna try this again so from what i can tell we have to run right about there and then run over here and then run over here so 
Uh, she's on passive, so we should be able to just do this. There we got it. One of them. Go right over here. Got the other one. And then if we run... There we got it. All right, finally. So that worked out well for us. Uh, and we did not get dotted. And we didn't lose... Still, or... Uh, we didn't lose invisibility, so that worked out like perfect for us. All right, hail him. He completed that task. And now he wants us to kill the shade. All right, so we're going to... We're going to decline that for right now because that is, uh, he's level 55 and we're just not going to have the, we're just not going to be able to do it yet. I mean, I don't even think I, I, I didn't even, did I kill the queen? Did I quit? I, I don't even remember if I killed the queen from uh, Stonehive at this point. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, I never killed the queen. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna have to go back and do that at some point. But she was just not doable at our current level. Anyway, so okay. We need to go talk to Devin real quick. So he's on the other side of these guys. So we can just run through here. Just remount. And... I think I'm gonna kill a bunch of snakes uh, and try to get that quest done. Have to do that offline because these things just do not drop their fang very often. All right, so we need to go here, right about there. We're gonna get attacked by these two guards for some reason, so kill them. Well, we're not gonna kill them because our guard, our mercenary, is not on. Uh... There we go. Let's go ahead and just dot this guy up and root him. Seems broken, but uh, whatever. There we go. It looks like there's another player over there, so... Hopefully we don't have to interact and we got to sneak inside this camp somehow and do something. What do we got to do here? I guess we just need to walk inside the camp. One down. I think I could sell those. That's junk. All right, well, she is doing that. Seder Horn. All right, well, she's doing that. Let's talk to Kosika. Kos Kosika first. All right, we did all those. Let's talk to him. More supplies for him, but accept that. All right, so that's another thing we need to do. So we need to like go in here, place their food with rocks. <laughs> All right. Let's see if we can figure out how to do this one. Do you just walk by this stuff? There's a tough and lock box. Oh, there we go. There's just walking by barrels, does it? Easy enough. All right, go speak to Soren. And we need to go loot four snake skins, four spider silk, and medium pelts. Okay. So let's go ahead and do that. Oh, we need to remake our pet. Go ahead and do that now. And 
And this should be an easy quest. Yeah, this should be fine. Uh, so this quest will go down... Where are we at? We're in more supplies. And then he wants us to go kill nymphs after this. So. Let's see here. Let's get that snake. I need to memorize pet haste. We did not get a fang. <laughs> uh, so, uh, so sad. Nor did we get a skin, snake skins. <laughs> So, I just sold a bunch of them, but they don't count unless you loot them. So, that's kind of, uh, kind of how it works. Which is kind of odd, really. I wish you could just turn them in if you've pre-looted them, but... Guess not. And we need to give, uh, weapons to our pet. Alright. There we go, and send him in. Alright, we got three snake skins. There's another snake up here. And I don't think the we the pets ignore like the weapon damage. They only use the proc and the delay, so fine steel seems fine enough for them. And I think by default, after a certain level, their attacks are always magic anyway. I don't know 100% on that, but, uh, all right, we got all this. Let's go over here. We need a medium quality wolf skin. I wish, uh, I wish necromancers had the pet buff expedients, like mages, so that the, <laughs> you could give Spirit of the Wolf to your uh, pet, but uh, it doesn't seem to be a thing. And I can't seem to cast the potions on the pet. Alright, we got a high quality one, unfortunately. <laughs> I would have thought that would have ever been an uh, unfortunate situation. I'm not sure what we lost. Okay, we got a thick one. Let's kill the named one. So I'm trying to I'm trying to get these episodes uh, at least a week out, uh, rendering time and uh, processing time on YouTube is taking longer and longer. <laughs> Uh, it's just weird. I don't know. Uh, I don't know why. It just, I don't know. Like a 30 minute episode is taking more than one day to process. So it's kind of getting, kind of getting time consuming. I just, I, uh, I have like six, six things rendering right now for different things. And, uh, I get all those uploaded and it takes, just takes days and days for those to all get uh, processed and ready to ready for release on YouTube. Uh, so the the good thing is that I can I pr like I pre write make all the descriptions and all that stuff and I I pre make the thumbnails. Typically, I have the thumbnail. Uh, like when I make the episode, I have the the, the screenshot I'm going to use for a thumbnail, and then it's just a matter of. Uh, opening up in Photoshop and getting it going, but like I can't do all of the processing, uh, all the, uh, all the settings and stuff and have it set to release until it's like processed in HD so I can double check everything. So it's kind of annoying because when it's not HD, I can't even read it. It's just hilarious. Like, <laughs> like it's, like the video is just like completely un unreadable uh like the text is so blurry it's just so funny really all right 
And I think by default, the first one it uses is uh, 320p. Oh, these aren't even... Oh, these will drop spider silk. Yeah, that's fine. So. And then I can uh, double check. Like, I'm trying to... Uh, I try to keep notes of every... Uh... No, this one. There. I've been trying to keep notes of all the quests we do in each one, but... It's usually... It's hard, it's hard to be accurate, because we, like, started... We started one quest in the first first time we got to this zone, and then uh, now we're uh, on a different one, and we're just now finishing this one. It's just it gets kind of a messy, so it's just more or less a best effort on my part, I guess. All right, we got one spider silk. These guys don't drop a lot of it, I guess. Get him to kill all these. Uh, let's see if he'll do it. I tagged each one of them, so hopefully he will. He has his queues long enough to kill all of those. Nope, it's a four mob queue, I guess. Yeah, kill those now. I was hoping it would be a, a larger queue, but I guess not. Let's go ahead and get him on that one. hilarious my uh my heater turned off because it hit hit uh, a certain time period i have uh i've automated all of my uh my thermostats to go to certain levels at certain times of the day and all kinds of stuff like that and it works all fine and dandy for uh for summer but uh there's no like winter option for it <laughs> And I didn't want to go through and change everything because I have like a, uh, I call it a, a deep sleep. It's like, uh, it's, it's like one thirty right now in the morning and it, I have the deep sleep is where I kind of like lower the temperature just a little bit. And then right before, uh, time to wake up, I start raising the temperature. And so I like, I like it a little colder, uh, at certain times of the day and stuff like that. So, and then like I have uh, like a dinner time one, so the the kitchen area gets cooler at dinner and stuff like that. And it uh, so far it's it works out really well for the summer, but uh, the winter it doesn't work out because everything it it kills like any like uh, auto adjustments that anybody has made throughout the day. So if like my wife turns on the heater because she's cold in, you know, a certain room. At a certain point, it'll auto-correct itself and turn everything off so that uh, there's not a room in the house that no one's in that is uh, wasting, uh, wasting electricity. All right, we got that one done. We need to deliver all that stuff. And before we do that, we'll go talk to Soren. Get that done. Let's greed that. Let's get out of this cave. Or we have to fight more spiders. Alright. He is up here. So we just go pop over here. What are we at with these guys? We're amiably to them and we've been I've been murdering them like the whole time. It's kind of funny. Uh Soren is the guy right here. Alright, we got five more uh faction with them. And yeah. That quest is done. We do an iron fine encampment. Devon, Teffen, Humor, Dynath, Capture, Show Them, Crush. I think we I finished all his quests. All right. Let's go ahead and go over to Devon and turn that in into him. And then I'll have to, uh, I'll have to do like a, quest inventory and see where we're at then so that was what was that one called biscuits are hard yeah that was on my list and this is more supplies for Devin okay that one's not on my list though and do we have to kill the guards again I bet they we do because they respond no, they didn't respond yet. Okay, so he wanted 
four snake skins. So snake skins, spider silk. We only got four of that. Uh, one medium quality bear and one medium quality wolf. We only got one of each of those. There we go. Speak to Devin. All right, testing. Nymphs and lemonade. Nymphs are a menace. So that's the next one. We need to go kill the nymphs, and that's gonna be a it's gonna be a pain. And what we'll do, we'll take that one to the next episode. Uh, and I'll look and see throughout all these other quests we have what we can do before that or during that. So uh, thank you for watching, and have a great day.